Every time I have to go to California, I'm like, I go through Yuma, I hit the other side, I'm looking back across the state line, the gas is 439, and I'm looking at the California gas, and it's 699, and diesel, and I'm just like, jeez, man. I don't, I'm talking, but I don't know what we're doing, folks. Uh, Sugar Ray, what you want to do, man? What they want to do? Y'all feel like dancing? Y'all understand the words that are coming out of my damn mouth? I said, do y'all feel like dancing? I mean, this is this is the last band, right? Oh, you got another band. Tommy Washington's coming up next, man. I just met that young man. Yeah. Plus, he from Texas like me, baby. All the best things in Texas are good. Mm -hmm. He ain't from Texas? I can't claim him? Well, damn, she's gonna step up for a way from him. Right you from right here? Yeah. All right, right here. Born and raised right here. All right, my boy. All right, all right. I can't claim him, huh? <laughs> I like him. Uh, let's, uh, let's shuffle a little bit. Let's see him yeah. up. Yeah. I don't care, y'all pick the key.
I am never gonna bite the hand that feeds me. Never. All right. Well, uh, how many people know who Donnie Dean is? Donnie Dean, the lead man, guitar mother, beat machine. Well, anyway, he was gonna be here. He's been sick for a minute, but he's okay. Uh, but he was gonna be here. But anyway, we're gonna do this in uh, honor of him because him and I did this together. Uh, so here you go. It's called Where the Hell Have You Been? <laughs>
thank you so much. You gotta make a little room. It's time in Washington right now. It's all about sucking and blowing, that's all I'm gonna say. And we do that. Yeah, we're gonna do that. Could we do one more? Could we do one? She said one more short one. Could we do one more long one? I, I actually, I really want to, I want to, I have a particular song I'd like to do that it might take about a minute and a half.
recognize this song? Oh, yeah. Tennessee Whiskey by Chris Stapleton, right? Yeah. And you might be wondering, why is that band doing a country song at the Arizona Blues Hall of Fame and does the ceremony? Are you wondering that? Because I'm wondering that. But I'm going to tell you why. Now this song was written a long time ago. And it was it was written by Steve, help me out, man. Dean Dillon. Dean Dillon. That's right, Dean Dillon out of Texas. Austin, Texas, I believe. He wrote songs for George Strait. You got any country fans in the house at all? So you probably know that this song, Tennessee Whiskey, was not a George Strait song, right? Dean Dillon wrote this song, took it to George Strait. George Strait said, I don't like it. So he took it to George Jones. George Jones said, I'll make a hit out of that. And he did. And you can waltz to it. Fast forward a little bit, Chris Stapleton, sitting in his office in Nashville, Tennessee, Great songwriter, singer, guitar player, everything. That motherfucker's a play. Did I say that out loud? He, he took the music from a little recording studio in Chicago called Chess Records. And he put those words to this music. And the reason that I want to do this song is to show you that it doesn't matter, blues is always relevant. Blues creeped into the top hits of the country charts. So back in 1967, at Chess Records in Chicago, they had a young lady named Jamesetta Hawkins. And she was doing some singing for him. You might know her better as Etta James. Right? 1967, she released an album called, called Tell Mama. So, with your permission, can we all get in a time machine and go back to the south side of Chicago in 1967? And let's walk in the front doors of the Checkerboard Lounge. And if we're lucky, on a Saturday afternoon or a Sunday afternoon, whatever day it is today, I don't even know, maybe we can see Etta James. And it might sound something like this. Carla, you got your microphone? All right, let's go, people. Something told me that it was over. When I saw you and that girl, I know all her time. Something did.
Hurricane Paul Brown against Knight. Jackie Lohan.